Hello YouTube, this is 2E0MDO, Edmund up in the attic, trying to film um, a homebrew 2 metre Yagi antenna and I can't take any credit for it, I only put it together, it was designed and cut to length by uh, a friend of mine who's very good at uh, designing and making antennas. Anyway, all it is, is a driven element at this end and a reflector at that end. There are no uh, directors on it and it's cut for the 2 metre band. So there's uh, then a little bit of coax which uh, I have the trusty Wuxon on the end of. It's pointing at the GP3 SR repeater in Brighton at the moment and that could be a, a distant repeater elsewhere on 145600 anyway um, in terms of length well the reflector which is longer I've got the ruler here it's sitting on top of the um, water tank by the way which uh, isn't made of metal so there's no problem there on the reflector from there to there is approximately 50 centimetres and then the same again up there into the rafters so about a metre in total and the driven element at this end is a little bit shorter from the bottom up to there is about 40 centimetres or so and uh, again on top there Although it's only sitting there on the water tank, I don't really want to move it because it's um, quite well aligned. And the coax goes in there, and I had trouble getting that in, I seem to remember, so I don't really want to take it off. But the inner core goes to the bit at the top, and the outer core, the braid, goes to the metal at the bottom. So there we are, that's a homebrew two meter antenna and just to prove that it works I've got uh, the Wuxon here one watt setting so let's try it and see what happens this is two echo zero Mike Delta Oscar testing and as you can hear even with the volume right up there's hardly any hiss at all and that's one watt. And the repeater's about 10 to 12 miles away as the crow flies. Um, I do benefit slightly from a sea path, but even so, that's not bad for one watt. So there we are. And indoor, it would work even better outdoors, I guess. But it seems to do all right here in the loft. There aren't any uh, metal pipes or metal cladding or anything around to cause problems for the single for the signal rather so there we are a homebrew two meter indoor yagi antenna